In this video lesson, we're going to focus on evaluating expressions with exponents that contain a zero or zero exponents. Now, what you need to know is that anything raised to the zero power is one. So the key here for solving these six problems is to know which number the zero applies to, because that's going to make the difference in finding the answer. 3 to the 0 is 1. 3x squared raised to the 0 power, the 0 applies to everything inside the parentheses, so this entire thing is 1. Now, 4x to the 0, the 0 applies to the x, but not the 4. The 4 has an invisible 1. If you don't see an exponent, always assume it's a 1. So 4 to the 1 is 4, x to the 0 is 1, so this becomes 4 times 1, which is 4. Now, a to the negative 3 times a to the 3. When multiplying, we can add the exponents. So this is a to the negative 3 plus 3. Negative, plus, negative 3 plus 3 is 0. And a to the 0 is 1. Now, for the next one, negative 3 to the 0 power. The 0 applies to everything inside the parentheses, so that's going to be 1. For the next one, the 0 only applies to the 3 and not the negative sign. This is equivalent to writing it this way. So this will be negative and then times 1, which is negative 1. Go ahead and try this. What's the answer for this one? The 0 exponent only applies to the 2x. So 2x to the 0, that will be replaced with 1 times a negative 8 outside of that gives us an answer of negative 8. So when simplifying expressions with zero exponents, it's important to identify what the zero applies to and what it does not apply to in order to get the answer.